I think a person with retinitis pigmentosa who is diagnosed at a relatively early stage of disease today is in a very different position than someone who was diagnosed with this disease 30 years ago. And largely that's due to the research that's been supported very heavily and generously by Foundation Finding Blindness. Today we understand so much more about how vision is lost and how vision is affected by retinal degenerations and treatments are really on the horizon. I think clinical trial research is advancing at a terrific pace. So I am very optimistic that in the next several years, there will be treatments that will slow the rate of vision loss. And I'm hopeful that in the future there will be cures. Certainly there are clinical trials right now for certain diseases, such as labor congenital amaurosis caused by mutations in RPE65, where there's real promise that gene therapy may provide a cure for that disease, which is completely even, was completely unheard of you know, 10 years ago or 15 years ago. So I think the outlook is very uh, optimistic and very promising. Um, certainly the research never goes as fast as we wish it would, and certainly it's never fast enough if you're the person facing this disease. So I would encourage people to become as active as they can be and get involved with the Foundation Fighting Blindness to learn more about the research that's going on and also to help push the research forward through helping with fundraising initiatives.